so first i'll go to my storage account okay so i'll create uh, one new storage account first okay. so create a storage account then i will create new storage one two three four someone is already using this that's what so bangalore okay then i'll create a storage account a review so this one for validation so once it complete then i'll create okay create a, a storage account that's it deployment in progress ഫ്രം കൂൾ ടു hot hot to cool and uh, hot to t like archive tier right okay so we come down i have one more option configuration right so we have to open this configuration so in this configuration you will be able to find uh, we have a different types of tiers see blob access tier default the default tier is hot tier okay so that is very expensive comparatively cool and arc okay so the default tier is hot uh, you can change cool as well but where is my archive tier where is archive tier see i am not able to access archive tier but, but i can access cool and hot tier right where is archive tier so the archive tier so we can only access object level okay you got it see we need to uh, like upload a object then only we can access archive tier okay so i'll go to my uh, container i'll go to my container so i'll create a container over here so my container hello ha ah. kitiyo ha ah, pabin aba suga hello ഓക്കെ ഓക്കെ അത് മാത്രം ഇത് മാത്രം മതി നോക്കാം കറക്റ്റ് കറക്റ്റ് ആ സമയത്ത് നമുക്ക് നോക്കാം നിങ്ങളെ നിങ്ങൾ എപ്പോഴത്തെ സമയത്തല്ലോ ആ സമയത്ത് ഞാൻ പറഞ്ഞില്ലേ ഒരു ആറ് മണിക്ക് ശേഷം ആറ് ടു ആറ് വരെ നമുക്ക് നോക്കാം ഓക്കെ ഓക്കെ ആ സമയത്ത് നോക്കാം ആ സമയത്ത് നോക്കാം ശരി ശരി ഓക്കെ 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 സക്സസ്ഫുള്ളി ഐ അപ്ലോഡഡ് വൺ ഇൻഡെക്സ് ഡോട്ട് എച്ച് ഡി എം എൽ ടു മൈ കണ്ടെയ്നർ സർവീസ് റൈറ്റ് So if I go to my container, you will be able to find index.html. I'll open this index.html. So here we will be able to find change tiers, right? So open this change tier, and here you can see that hot, cold, and archive. Okay. So this archive, sorry, this uh, archive tier only available in object level. Okay. So you have to upload object, then you have to choose the archive tier. Okay. So what are the tiers we have? Hot, cold. rqt so they will ask okay what are the tiers we have how i can reduce my uh, like expense okay by just keeping this data and all so they will tell okay i have some data and i don't want to retrieve the da data frequently so i want to keep this data like for 10 years but i don't want to retrieve the data because it's a some critical data okay so which tier you going to choose suitable 
Hmm? RK, see, because I, I don't want to retrieve the data and I want to store this data for a 10 years, right? We can store in, uh, we can store in RK or else uh, if you want to retrieve the data frequently, then you can go with the uh, hot or cool as well, right? Cool also, it's uh, infrequent, but it's comparatively, so we can access the data uh, like uh, uh, RK. Okay. So uh, next, uh, let's see how we can create uh, life cycle rules. Okay. So first I'll go to my storage. So in storage, you'll be able to find a life cycle management over here. Uh, click on life cycle management. So we can create a rule over here. Uh, click add a rule. Okay. So here you'll be able to find end a rule name. So I'll create a rule. This is my rule one. Okay. So then come down. So we can filter the data, for example, limit the block with the filters. In the sense, see, suppose you have a two folders, okay? And you want to filter one folder. In the sense, only one folder has to be moved from one tier to another tier, okay? Or else you can give apply rule to all blobs in storage account, okay? And this we will learn what is a block blobs and append block. We will learn that, okay? Uh, block subtips, okay, fine. Then click next, okay? Here you can see that enter value. So I will uh, give a value over here, 20 days, okay? So then I will select move to cool storage. Okay. So whenever you upload in the data, first it will come to hot tier. Then after 20 days, it will go to cool tier. Again, you can give another condition. Okay. You can give a value over here, uh, 50 days. Okay. So it has to go to archive tier or delete the blob store. You can, you can just select like that. Okay. So automatically, so when it expires, it will delete the file uh, or if you want, you can just go to archive tier. It will not go to delete, but it will go to our cube tier. Okay, automatically it will change from one tier to another tier. Okay. So then click add. Successfully created a rule. Okay, so whenever you're keeping any data on this container, okay, this uh, life cycle, this storage account, so automatically the data will be moved from uh, hot to cool, then cool to our cube tier. But the data is not going to delete. Okay. Any doubts? Hmm? Any doubt? No. So next is Azure Explorer. 